Hello everyone, welcome back to Code Step by Step. And in this Vue.js 3 video tutorial, we will learn about before create and created lifecycle methods. We have three main points for this video. We will learn when they are called, example for before create and created, and interview questions also. In Vue.js, we have total eight lifecycle methods, and remaining six lifecycle methods we will learn in the upcoming three videos. And uh, Keep in mind, lifecycle methods not actually belong to your application. They, they belong to your uh, application's component. So let's say in your application, you have 50 components. So every component have separate lifecycle methods, right? Uh, now let's start with the first point when they called. So firstly, we'll talk about before create. Before create lifecycle method will execute before creating your component nothing will be execute before create lifecycle method i can show you and after your component will create and you can say that basically your uh, execution of uh, javascript part of your component will be complete and then created lifecycle method will, method will be called so now you can ask that so what about html part so html part will be covered inside the mounting uh, lifecycle method so in the the next two lifecycle methods which is uh, before mount and uh, mounted and they will basically uh, related to the html template part right so first first thing is before create will be execute before creating anything nothing will be executed before it and uh, first of all it will create then your data properties methods will be ready and then your created method will be called i can show you first of all i am just uh, creating uh, before create lifecycle method and i am going to make an alert here because alert will stop your execution until we are pressing the ok so let me just uh, put here console and now you will find that so for that uh, so that we can check that everything we can refresh this page and now you will find that nothing is displayed here that means not our html is ready i mean template part and nothing here is uh, executed uh, first of all this method will be called and now you will find that everything is created here so now what you can see that you can also put here created method and uh, again if you make an alert here and just simply put here created same thing you will be find here first of all before create method will be called and after that created method will be called html part will not gonna ready uh, till the both are in a progress here you can see that i'm just refreshing it now you will find that before created is called now created is called and now you will find that your html will be ready so how you can find that uh, uh, this javascript part will be uh, created between before create and created right how we can see that for that you can just simply make a console here so let me just make a console dot one and let me put here data is created right and now you will find that let me just clear all these things and make the application refresh again before created is called I can just uh, here you can see that okay uh, let me just refresh everything again uh, just give me a moment I think browser gonna hang I think it will not uh, clearing the uh, console so let me just open the new tab 8080 and uh, I must have to open the dev tool also so let me call it now you will find that before created is called after that data is created and after that we have this console right so you might be think that uh, okay data created might be called first after that data uh, created lifecycle method is called first then this data is created because uh, i will show you uh, another example for this one but here you can see that if created method is calling called first then it will stop the execution and this should not be print here till we i am pressing ok right so 
first create before is called then our data methods and computed property will be ready and after that create method is called i can show you one more example uh, let me just uh, make a, take a property here let's say my property name is uh, name which is anil right and i can just simply alert it right here like anil right sorry uh, which is name tick and now what i can do here i am just changing okay first of all let's check that this is working fine or not i need to just clear all this console and all because uh, i think they are before create created and uh, due to the alert there is some issues i think right okay, let me let me just uh, okay now you can see that anil is here that is working fine there is a no issue so if i am just trying to change here inside before create this dot name is siddhu then you will find that this is not gonna change here right let me uh, just re refresh it again and you will find anil is still there the reason is firstly before created is called and after that these properties are created it, that's why this is not changed so if i am changing this here inside created then you will find that uh, now uh, name properties has been changed we can refresh it again and here you can see that right so this is an interview question in the interview question they might ask that uh, what happen if we just trying to change the property inside before create this will not gonna change right so thanks for watching this video if you still have any kind of confusion you can ask me in the comment box don't forget to subscribe my channel and like this video